in this video I'm going to describe the new feature of being able to record a payment of which you've already received for an invoice. So if we go to um, the banking first, you will be able to see for the purposes of this video just the names of our banks. Um, this is important because this will come up later when we're raising our invoices. So we go to sales and we go to invoice. And we create a new invoice. So new, and I'm going to do this for dropping beans. And we're going to say in here that this was consultancy. And we'll say that's for £100. And we'll add our button. So when we've done this, there is a little section down the bottom saying, I have received the payment. So what you can do is you can say, actually, I got paid um, by bank transfer into my main bank account. And we can enter that in. Or what you can do is you can split this payment and say, actually, I only received £100 in from the bank, but I actually received another payment, which was cash, for £20. What this will do here is it'll enter the balancing amount as zero. Now, when we hit save, against this invoice, you will now see that this invoice has been marked as sent and it's also been marked as paid. And we can see the two payments that have been entered and we can see the journal of putting this directly into the bank for us. It's a really clever way to make sure that you are only entering one transaction and marking that as paid and keeping your records fully up to date.